Michael and I have been married for three years. The biggest problem in our marriage is my weight. Allison was 130 pounds, always working out. This is my trophy wife that I remember. Now I'm a size 22 and I weigh 249 pounds. I gained 80 pounds in the last two months of my pregnancy from eating corn dogs, lots of corn dogs, and milkshakes and fries. Allison's fat because she's lazy because she doesn't want to put the effort to go to the gym. You said you wanted a bike, we got you the bike, and you said that the bike was too hard. 250 pounds on a bike, not comfortable. I've tried dieting and working out, and the weight just doesn't come off like it used to. How's Emily doing? Emily. My husband refers to my stomach as Emily. Michael calls me names a lot. He calls me Chunky Monkey, Heifer, and Hippo, and Bat. Ass. I do make comments just to make her feel bad about herself. I'm afraid he'll leave me. I'm afraid that he'd cheat on me. I'm afraid that he'll go and find some toothpick to replace me. I think that um, the weight's part of our problems, but I think that he needs to, you know, be Are, are you attracted to her? I'm not, not attracted, attracted to her at all. You no. don't find her attractive at all? I, I don't want to be seen with her in public. I don't want to. I take her out to movies late at night and at reserved seating, so we just go in the theater and we can get out as soon as possible. I, I try to stay in my office as long as I can, so I don't have to come up with any reason to come out and hang out with her. Yeah. But are, are I you think, all intimate? Do you, are you sexually active? Not really. We used to have sex six times a day, now maybe once a month. You used it, to have sex six times a day? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> a lot. A lot. Well, no wonder you're just tired. <laughs> I'm having a hard time wrapping my mind around this. You're, you're saying you're ashamed to take this woman out somewhere? Yes. I like my trophy wife. When she was 130, when I met her, that's the person I fell in love we with. Went, we literally went out and just did everything. And yeah, we did everything had together. Fun. So why have you stayed? I mean, if you're so ashamed of her, if she's so despicable and disgusting to you, because, why have you stayed? Because we have a, a son together. He's three years old. I mean, so I'm that's not, it. You're just staying for the child. I, I, I don't want to. I don't. I want my son to have a you know mother and father. But for him, you'd be gone. If it wasn't for him, I'll be gone. But if she would have listened to me from the beginning, she wouldn't be where she is. Because the doctor gave her a list, told her not to eat salt, not to eat pasta, don't eat fatty food. What did she ask? Corn dog. A box of corn dog in two days. And then instead of using ketchup, she puts the corn dog in the ice cream as a ketchup. <laughs> yeah. She wants McDonald's. She wants a, a spicy chicken sandwich. She wants milkshake, fr lunch, french fries. I was Those are the things craving. I told her. I was hungry. Like she gained five pounds every month till she hit seven months. And then she I gained 65 pounds one month. The doctor said that's not healthy for your kid. Pounds. What, what do you weigh? I weigh 200. 200? <laughs> yes. He's not exactly the picture of perfect health either. <laughs> Again, that way for eating the junk you ate when you were pregnant. Uh, there's a lot of women out there right now thinking, hey, I know how you could lose 200 pounds in a hurry. <laughs> uh, <laughs> do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.